Hi, my name is Molly, and I'm here to talk about air pollution, the silent killer. Air pollution is a major environmental problem that is causing serious health problems for people all over the world. In this video, we will discuss the causes of air pollution, its effects on human health, and what we can do to reduce it. Air pollution is a major environmental problem that is causing serious health problems for people all over the world. The World Health Organization estimates that air pollution is responsible for 7 million deaths each year, making it the fourth leading cause of death globally. What is air pollution? Air pollution is the presence of harmful substances in the air that can cause health problems. These substances can come from a variety of sources, including cars, trucks, factories, power plants, and even dust and dirt. The health effects of air pollution. Air pollution can cause a variety of health problems, including heart disease, stroke, lung cancer, asthma, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD, premature death. The causes of air pollution. The main causes of air pollution are burning fossil fuels, the burning of fossil fuels, such as coal, oil and natural gas, is the main source of air pollution. When these fuels are burned, they release harmful pollutants into the air, including carbon monoxide, nitrogen oxides, sulfur dioxide, and particulate matter. Industry Factories and other industrial operations also release harmful pollutants into the air. These pollutants can include heavy metals, volatile organic compounds, VOCs, and asbestos. Transportation. Cars, trucks, and other vehicles are a major source of air pollution. When these vehicles burn fuel, they release harmful pollutants into the air, including carbon monoxide, nitrogen oxides, and particulate matter. Agriculture. Agriculture can also contribute to air pollution. When crops are sprayed with pesticides, these pesticides can drift into the air and pollute the air. Construction. Construction activities can also contribute to air pollution. When buildings are demolished or new buildings are built, dust and dirt can be released into the air. What we can do to reduce air pollution. There are a number of things that we can do to reduce air pollution, including drive less. One of the best ways to reduce air pollution is to drive less. If you can, walk, bike, or take public transportation instead of driving. Use public transportation. If you can't walk, bike, or take public transportation, try to carpool or use a van pool. This will help to reduce the number of cars on the road and reduce air pollution. Walk or bike when possible. If you can walk or bike to your destination, do so. This will help to reduce air pollution and get you some exercise at the same time. Take public transportation. If you can't walk or bike, take public transportation. This will help to reduce the number of cars on the road and reduce air pollution. Carpool or vanpool. If you have to drive, carpool or vanpool with co-workers or friends. This will help to reduce the number of cars on the road and reduce air pollution. Walk or bike to the grocery store. If you can, walk or bike to the grocery store. This will help to reduce air pollution and get you some exercise at the same time. Buy locally grown food. When you buy locally grown food, you help to reduce the amount of transportation pollution that is created. Recycle and compost. Recycling and composting help to reduce the amount of waste that is sent to landfills. Landfills are a major source of methane, a greenhouse gas that contributes to climate change. Conserve energy. Conserving energy helps to reduce the need for power plants, which are a major source of air pollution. Support clean energy. Support policies that promote clean energy, such as solar and wind power. Clean energy helps to reduce air pollution and combat climate change. Air pollution is a serious problem that is causing serious health problems for people all over the world. However, there are a number of things that we can do to reduce air pollution. By taking steps to reduce our own carbon footprint and supporting policies that promote clean energy, we can help to make a difference. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. I hope you liked it. If you did, please consider subscribing to our channel and hitting the bell icon so you don't miss any future videos. We are always working on new content and we would love for you to be a part of it.